What's up muscle car people? This is Bring It Muscle Cars and I'm Matt. We got Kenny working the camera and I got some big news. We got phase four coming for the GT500. And you know what that means? It's time things get real. 700 horsepower, that's pretty real. That's pretty fast. We got a lot of suspension work done. We got a one piece drive shaft, but guess what? The clutch went. It's still slow, I'm slow. Guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get the no driving mother uh, checklist. One, I'm gonna get a turbo 400. It's gonna be a built turbo 400. Probably will handle like 2,000 horsepower. Am I gonna be making 2,000? Nah, won't be doing that. But I won't have to worry about shifting because I'm gonna get better launches. It's gonna be faster. Number two, what I'm getting I'm gonna be getting a roll cage put in. Cause guess what? I'm gonna be so fast, they're gonna kick me out of the track. Cecil County will be like, get out of here. Maple Grove will be like, get out of here. You're too fast without a cage. So we're gonna have a cage put in. How do I feel about the cage? Uh, not too happy about it. I bought this over a Corvette because I could take my kids with me. And now I won't have a back seat. I don't feel comfortable putting a cage in even around the seats and having them in it. I just don't want to do that. So I won't have back seats, but it will be caged. We're going to paint it, match the body. So that will be neat. We're going to do the painting ourselves. We're also going to be doing a built motor. So I haven't decided what's going to go on top of the built motor or what type of force induction I'm going with. I want to go with the Gen 3 VMP or maybe a Gen 3 Whipple, or maybe a Hellion twin turbo kit. Can't go custom twin turbo, because I'd like the car back sometime this year. I'm gonna send the car off to Steve Drummond Racing, or Race Cars, whatever it is. I'll put the link down below so you can check him out. He builds some super fast cars. Last summer, he raced Kai Kelly, and he beat him. He has like two, six or seven second legit street cars. One's a Camaro and one's a Mustang. So I think he can pretty much handle this. My goal is, let's say, fast. I see these guys on YouTube, Guitar Mangeddon, Street Speed 717, whatever Corey's channel is, all these guys doing big builds, making their car go fast. And guess what? I'm gonna be right there with them. Me and Mrs. Shelby, me and the missus, we're gonna bring it next year. We're gonna challenge all those guys when she's done and we're gonna bring it and we're gonna destroy everybody. We're gonna line them up one by one, take them down one by one. We're gonna bring on the Panda if he'll race me. Maybe I'll just give him a car. Maybe that's what he'll say. That's the only way he'll race me. I don't know, but we're gonna have some good times this year. Hopefully we're gonna get it done before the end of April and the, so the next big thing I got to do before I bring it over there is we're going to have to gut the car. So that's going to have to happen. So if you live near me or if you're on YouTube and you got a fast car, John, Doc, any of these guys, you better be ready to bring it in 2018. All right, guys, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button because we need subscribers because I'm not going to make any money, not that I'm making any money on YouTube already. But I definitely won't make any money until I get to a thousand subscribers. So hit those buttons, hit that notification so you get the GT500 updates, you get the uh, G8 side chick updates. So that way you can stay up to date with both cars, with TJ's car, with Kenny's Lotus, with Sipes, uh GT. So you better bring it. Thanks for watching. Hit that like button. Thanks a lot, guys. Before we close out, we got to do a little Easter egg. <laughs> Just want to throw this out here. See if we can make it show up. We can't. We might have to go from the inside. That's why. That's why I didn't see it for three months, four months. The Shelby is smashing. Oh yeah. How long did it take you to notice that, Matt? Uh, 
uh, at least four months, right? I think we put on on Thanksgiving and he realized it last weekend. Yeah. Because the car hasn't moved since Thanksgiving, since before Thanksgiving. One, two, three, 